Hello YouTube and welcome back. This is Nico and you're watching Dared Game. Today we're playing Red Dead Redemption 2 and we're going to be doing the first in a series of weapons guides. This one being uh, revolvers. And what I'm going to do in each one of these guides is go through the revolver class and rank the base revolvers in the game. No legendary ones, obviously, just ones that you can buy at the store from worst to best. In the case of revolvers, there are three, so it'll be three to one. Uh, with that in mind, all of these weapons have all the max upgrades, and they're all using standard ammunition for this guide. So with all that in mind, uh, the scale is 0 to 80, 80 being the best, 0 being the worst. Obviously, there's no weapon that gets a 0, uh, and they're based on all of the rank bar uh, on the damage bars that you see in the description screen. So with all that in mind, let's just start it off with number 3. So at number 3, we have the Double Action Revolver. Uh, now, this is a... Like I said, or I should have said, I don't know if I did, but all the weapons in this game are good. Rockstar went to great lengths to make sure that, you know, each weapon in a class may have one thing that it does better than the rest, but when you average them all out, they're all very close. So on my scale, the double action revolver ended up getting 43. Uh, so that's, it's the worst in here, but obviously, you know, <laughs> not by much. But anyway. So the pros of this, it's got the highest fire rate and uh, better reload than the other two. And then the cons are it has the lowest damage out of them, the lowest accuracy, and the worst range. Uh, so with all that in mind, you know, it's a decent looking gun as you can see. Uh, it's not bad, we can do a little combat demo. Now obviously reload takes a while with the double actions, but the firing rate is greatly increased over all the single action revolvers because of the fact that you don't have to cock it between rounds. So that is number three, the double action revolver. So next up at number two, we have the Schofield revolver. Now this one in many people's opinions is obviously the most attractive and a lot of people's favorite in the game, but it does come in short on a couple things. But So basically the ranking for this one is 47 out of 80. Uh, it's got high damage, uh, the highest out of the three in fact, and great accuracy, um, not the highest, but, you know, middle of the road. It's got medium range, so decent range. Uh, where it suffers is fire rate and reload time. It takes a while with that. But with that in mind, it's obviously a very attractive, and if you're going for damage, you can't beat it. Uh, so let's do a little combat demo quick. As you can see, the fire rate is slower because, again, you have to cock it between each one. And then reload time is a bit faster than the double action, but still pretty slow. But like I said, they're good guns, you know. But with all that in mind, let's move on to the first, you know, the one that got first place. Alright, so here for first place, we of course have the Cattleman's Revolver, the only stock revolver left in the game. This one receiving a ranking of 48, so only one point better than the Schofield, so not that much different. Uh, this one has the best range, it's got great accuracy... Uh, the damage is just below the skull field, you know, so it's not as high, but almost as high. It's got medium fire rate, medium damage, and the only downside is it has the slowest reload out of all of them. Uh, with all that in mind, uh, it's a beautiful weapon. It's the traditional single-action cowboy revolver that you'd expect to see in a western game like this. Uh, but let's see how it does in a fire. You can see that the fire rate is slightly more than the Schofield revolver. Uh, the accuracy is uh, similar. Actually, I think it's exactly the same. But the uh, personally, in my opinion, I think the Cattleman revolver looks better. Uh, with all that in mind, all three of these revolvers have uh, an ammo capacity of six rounds, and they are all fantastic weapons. But that is the ranking from three to one. Well, that's another video in the books. I hope you liked it. If you did, smash that like button, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to put some links on the screen here to help you subscribe and maybe see another video. But in any case, thanks for watching, and have a nice day. I'll see you next time.